I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Join us for the Multicultural Club meeting today. Use the Google Meet code MULTICULTURALTHS. Remember to log into your regular Flex class for attendance. See you there. The THS Cooking Club will be meeting Friday the 13th during Flex on Google Meet to make vegan blueberry muffins with Mrs. Nichols as our guest. Join us for some yummy food and fun as we bake together live. The Google Meet nickname is McLean THS. Join our Schoology group with code PPXT83R4GQJ6P or email Mr. Feinberg or Mrs. McLean for questions. Mark your calendars. FBLA will be hosting a Chipotle fundraiser on Wednesday, November 18th from 4 to 8 p.m. at the Westview location. Come support our future business leaders and help cover the cost of the regional competition. Use the online code on the screen or show a copy of the flyer in the store. Current juniors, applications are now open for the Werner H. Kirsten Science Internships at NCI in the United States Army Medical Research Institute of Infectious Diseases, both at Fort Detrick. Interns must be 17 years old by the start of the internships. Deadline to apply is December 13th, but early applicants have an advantage. Apply for both internships online using the site on the screen. Contact Mrs. Mummert at elizabeth.mummert at fcps.org for more information. Good morning, Titans. This is Mrs. Bush back with another tech tip to help free up some hard disk space on your Chromebook. When you do screenshots and downloads, um, you may be pasting them into a Google Doc or sharing them in Schoology, but they're all still stored in your files folder on your hard drive. You can go to the technology support page and have directions on how to do that. Or you can actually just from your launcher, go ahead and type files and you'll be able to see all the files that are being stored on your device. You can individually go in and delete all of these. If you still need some, you can upload them to your Google Drive. Or one quick way of just getting rid of all the old things that are being stored on the device is to go ahead and sign out of your Chromebook and remove your profile. We've done that at the end of each school year and when you sign out, your name will pop up with a box, a little arrow on the, to the right. Click on the down arrow next to your name and select remove user or remove account. That way, that will remove any local data on this Chromebook. Everything else that you've worked on in the Google Drive and everything is all web-based, so that will still be there. That will free up a lot of disk space. Also, just removing the profile sometimes solves a lot of other issues with connectivity and syncing between Google Drive and Schoology and also resolves any issues you may have with any personal accounts that you're logged into. Remember, I'm here by email or you can call the school if you need any support. Have a great day.